and we are seeing a big no with capital letters to the new funding model. The government is not listening. In the recent weeks, this has been the order of the day. Tunataka kutumia the old model. Students and lecturers contesting the much pushed for new funding model in the universities. The new funding model has come under critical scrutiny, making education more expensive and disadvantaging students from poor background. There's been cases, legitimate cases. And buying to the pressure was President William Ruto, who despite several attempts to convince varsity students of the efficacy of the new funding model, fell on deaf ears. And to address this talmud, the head of state through a Gazette notice has appointed a strong 129 member committee. The committee which comprises members from different fields such as Wasu Secretary General Constantine Wasonga as well as university students will see Professor Japheth Michenin Tiba sit at its helm in chairmanship capacity. The National Working Committee will compose of four work streams each with its own leadership and will be assigned different tasks accordingly. The composition include the work stream to review the university funding model, the work stream on appeals arising from categorization of students, work stream on structure of student loans, and work stream to review cost of academic programs. Parts of the reviews to be looked into by the work streams include to review the efficacy of the new funding model, to evaluate the effectiveness of the means testing instrument for students' categorization, to establish the potential of the new funding model, to analyze and recommend the cost of university programs, and to review the structure of students' loans. <laughs> Meanwhile, the National Committee has two months to consolidate a report and the same presented to President William Ruto through the Ministry of Education. Milia Kisienya, K24 TV.